In this video, we're going to look at how to create a data entry uh, form. Now, I've already created a table with a number of fields in, and I've put two uh, records in already. Notice that my username is a coded field, which is made up of the first initial, the last initial, and a sequentially increasing number. This is a generated form using the form wizard, and it's very easy to use. You click on Create, Form Wizard, you choose the table you're basing it on, in this case I've only got personal table, you add across all the fields, and simply click on Finish. That will generate something which looks like this. The benefit of using the Form Wizard is that most of the hard work is done, and then you can focus on adding the code. Now in order to set this to be data entry only, I need to go to Home, and design view. Once you're on this view, you need to make sure you can see the properties, which may not always be visible. So you need to right click and go form properties. I'm just going to make that slightly bigger so we can read it easily. Now, the next thing you need to do is select the form, click on data, and go down to here where it says date entry. At the moment it's set to no, and what that means is I can see the records that are already there. Let's actually have a look at what this looks like at the moment. As you can see, it's got my first record filled in, and if I click on the next button down here, it's got my second one. I want to, when I'm creating a data entry form, only have a new blank one which I can save. So, once I come back to my design view, I find form, go to data, and go back to data entry, and I just simply click on yes. I save this, and then I go back to design view. Notice that the records have disappeared. There's no data in here. This is now only a data entry form.